your dream comes from a few people gandhi ji dreamed india must be free somewhere in maybe you know 1940s it might have been unbelievable i think narendra modi ji is now dreaming that india must be corruption free so not many people can dream here is one guy who dreams that india must be inclusive and i think that's a great dream so firoz is the dreamer and when you have person who dreams big there could there must be people who really follow and execute that dream and being from operations and technologies as my job i have execution bias so i told firoz you dream there are a set of people who would execute it's not just me it's a huge set of champions in sap and also in nz and alleges who are really making this function today you know just we started but i'm very sure that it will be a success i just thought i'll share two learnings that i had in the past year because i've been working with persons with disability so i thought i'll just share that because firoz has already spoken about the dream highly technical so let me make it simple so the first story is that you know i spoke to many people to just validate what i heard uh, what i read in newspaper i think it was mr chaturvedi i don't know whether i'm getting his uh, i think it's mr chaturvedi he was watching a movie in a movie theater uh, along with a long many people and then the national anthem sang so everybody stood up this person was sitting and the crowd two or three of people in the crowd got really very upset that he was not standing up and not respecting the national anthem of india and without asking any questions they got aggressive they really scolded him they almost beat him and then they realized that he is on a wheelchair so i spoke to a lot of people and said why are we assuming we are assuming that here is a person who is not respecting the national anthem this is true even in a work environment in all walks of life we assume that persons with disability can do this cannot do this and what they are telling the people whom we are working with abled and disabled must be treated same please do not assume ask when in doubt ask and i think that's a great learning for me personally because many a times when i saw i must tell you that i'm trying to eliminate the biases that i have it's not easy therefore it is so important that we have these awareness forums this india inclusion summit it is not over we are still not aware we are still not inclusive so i think it's so critical for us to understand what is it that everybody needs ask when in doubt ask i think that's a great learning that i have and today i just you know it comes naturally if we practice it and i think it's very very critical the other story you know i was following harman and i saw a note from her saying that don't tell that i am inspirational the minute you say that somebody you know the dancers they are vision impaired oh my god the dance was inspirational honestly we are trying to say that they are they are visually impaired therefore they cannot dance and they have danced so it's inspirational maybe we are trying to be nice but i think we should take away that and say that anybody can do anything if i can walk even a person on a wheelchair can walk why are we assuming why do we call them inspirational treat everyone the same everyone is good at something there's no doubt about it and i can stand very proudly and say that all the three organizations sap ans and analogies we have been trying to give employment for a lot of people with many kinds of disabilities and they are no different to the others so it's a great opportunity for us to celebrate to celebrate differences to bring unsung heroes to this podium there are people who have never danced they are going to come and dance here and we want to give a forum for them to really show that we can and we are not different and we are the same please treat us with the manner that you would treat anybody else and that's really the forum and it's a movement there is no doubt about it why i say is in the last 3 years that i am involved so many champions are coming up and the ripple effect is increasing i don't know how to measure it but it is measured by the number of new people who come in every year in my mind and if each one of us becomes inclusive 
then it is like 250 into 1 into 2 into 3 and it just multiplies and that's we are that's what we are aiming for have a great evening thank you